Yo, what's good, my people? This is Smolito, Smolito's Way, coming at you with another video. Hit that like, hit that subscribe, show some love, follow on Young OG 3000. So let's get into this, man. Yesterday, um, on live, on Instagram Live, Hocus 4 5th and Hassan Campbell uh, talked out their differences. And uh, it was wavy. It was a good one, man. It was, it was good to see two dudes you know hash things out in a positive way and come to a understanding and and you know have mutual respect for each other and it was good man it was good hocus you know i follow hocus on instagram also i follow hassan campbell shout out to both of them um basically hocus was upset about you know hassan he's very opinionated and hocus and Hassan are from, you know, the Bronx as, as well as I, I am too. But they, uh, you know, Hassan is an old school dude. And he was around when, you know, the era when uh, Pistol Pete, the leader of uh, Sex Money Murder was out. And he had a lot of, you know, he had a lot of things to say about that, you know, Pete. And uh, a lot of things that rubbed Hocus 4 the wrong way. And Hocus let him know about that, you know. And uh, Hassan was the bigger man and, and reached out to him and, you know, they both, you know, came to a mutual agreement and apologized for, you know, they, they had words, but they didn't lead, they didn't let that lead to, you know, something unfortunate, which I wish a lot of the dudes today, rappers and, and, and people, people in general would just understand that sometimes, you know, as men or women or whatever, you can have a conversation with somebody sometimes it's not that serious and it's not too far gone where you can come to a understanding with the person that you have an agreement with a disagreement with and 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 figure it out positively and not take it to another level where shit gets ugly um they had a real good discussion they were talking about you know all type of problems in the in the community and and uh talking about black lives matter and you know how they disagree with a lot of the things that they're doing and like I said, it was just good to see two dudes with big platforms come to an understanding, you know, reach out to each other and, and hash things out in a, in a constructive, positive way. And I hope that this is an example for more people that this doesn't, you know, you don't have to take it there all the time. It doesn't have to come to, you know, gunplay or violence or, 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 or stuff like that, man. A, a simple conversation could solve and deter a lot of problems people like it doesn't don't believe all this bullshit and the rap music and all that or whatever the fuck you, like sometimes man as grown men as grown individuals we can we can talk it out man that's a positive thing it's a positive thing and i i, I give all respect to both of them for doing that and and not, not only doing it they could have done it behind the scenes and that would have been just as good but for them to come on instagram live and they were talking for a good minute. Must have been at least an hour and a half, maybe more. And, you know, they, they, they settled their differences. So shout out to them, man. And like I said, I hope that this is something that others can take from and learn about. And, 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 really, and really just, you know, use to their advantage. You know what I'm saying? Because this shit got to stop, man. People dying over nonsense. People, you know, disrespecting each other, disrespecting dead homies, dead, you know, everything. Like, it doesn't have to be that way, man. It shouldn't be that way. So, like I said, big shout out to Hocus 4 Fifth. Big shout out to Hassan Campbell. Both of them dudes, you know, handled themselves like men. And I can appreciate that, for real. Um, it's good for the, It's good for everybody, man. It really is, you know. These two dudes are, are influential in their own right. Hassan has a huge following on uh, Instagram. I mean, on um, on YouTube. And Hocus has a good, uh, decent-sized following himself. He's very, you know, he's very uh, outspoken on a lot of real issues that go on in the community. He's very, very uh, outspoken about health, you know, being healthy. And, and you know, he's, he's really... He's really uh, he comes from a, a walk of life, he, you know, that he, he's changed a lot and he's grown and, you know what I'm saying? And we should support that, man. We shouldn't always look for the negative people. We should always, we should try to acknowledge the change and the growth, man. So 
it was a big thing, man. I, I watched the whole thing. I uh, I learned a lot from them. Hassan was dropping jewels, and, and so was Hocus. And, and you know, like I said, man, it's, it was good to see them two dudes really just figure it out on a, in a positive way, in a positive light, man. So I just wanted to speak on that real quick, man. Um, yeah, you know, I think that Hocus put it up on Insta. I mean, on on YouTube. So if y'all want to see it personally, I think you can you can look at it yourself and, and see you know all the things that they touched on. And um, that's about it, man. It's your boy Smolito's way coming at you, letting you know what's going on in this in this world. And um, y'all stay tuned, man. Be safe out there. Take care of each other. Follow, subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Like the like the video. Follow on Young OG 3000. Y'all be good out there.